What happened? You've been resting. For how long? Uh, about a day. You were having really bad nightmares. With the infection and the fever, I thought we'd have to go to the hospital. No, Kendall, we can't. Look, no. I told you we can't do that. It's okay, Aiden. It's all right. It's all right. We're safe. We're safe. And you still need to rest. But I think the fever is gone. You're getting better. Thanks to you. Oh, I think your fever broke. Really? Yeah. That's a good sign. I better go for my lazy bum now. Okay. Oh, hang on, hang on. That's what I thought. Okay, you haven't eaten in 24 hours, Aiden. You need to get your strength back. Relax. You need some soup. Kendall. Thank you. Oh, for what? Oh, for staying up all night, watching over me, making sure I don't die. Aiden, I'm the one who should be thanking you. I mean, if, if you hadn't gotten me out of the hospital, Zach and I would both be in prison. So thanks to you, my boys can be with their dad until I'm in the clear. And now you're stuck here with me. I suppose it's uh, better than being in prison. You could say that. A wee bit better. <laughs> Open up. This is my favorite. I knew that. The sodium. you got my last letter and that you understand now why I had to run. I know you're worried, but you don't have to be. I'm safe. I miss you so much. All I can think about is being together again. You, me, and the boys. Thanksgiving. That vision is pulling me through, giving me hope. As I write these words, I know you're doing everything you can to make it so I can come home. Until then, we have a place to stay. It's a little run down, but... Are you bloody insane? The DA's office, the police, they're all waiting for any sign of contact from you. Oh, Aiden, come on, I'm not stupid, all right? I didn't say where we are. Well, the postmark might. The paper you're using, too. All right, might lead them right to us. Okay. Um... Oh, all right. Stop, stop. Just come sit down. Be careful. Sit down. Be careful. Listen to me, Aiden. I just need to let Zach know that I'm all right. Kendall, it's too risky. Please, Aiden, please. The way we left was so sudden. I mean, the, the, the look on Zach's face. He and I have spent so much time fighting. We have grown so far apart. I didn't think we'd ever find our way back. But we did. Right before you and I left, Zach and I turned a corner. Things were really good. So I really need him to know that this wasn't a betrayal. Yeah, well, that was part of your problems with Zach. Well, it started with you. And then there was Reese. And then Ryan, that was a huge disaster. <laughs> That whole time, that seemed so unreal to me. I mean, coming, coming out of my coma was like waking up in an alternate universe where nothing made any sense. I didn't recognize anyone, not even myself. Everything was, was crazy. I mean, I had a new heart. Bianca had Zach's baby. Greenlee was gone. I lost my best friend, and then I almost lost my son. You and Zach, the, you, you remarried? Yeah, only so he wouldn't have to testify against me. But then Zach came up with this crazy plan to 
lock me in a secret room in our house, and that's when things started to change. We were forced to face each other and face our issues and deal with what we had lost. But then we realized there was still so much there. We still had a future and hope, love. But we didn't have any time. We never really connected. So that's why I really, really need this connection. So even though I'm gone, Zach knows I'm still with him. I'll always be with him. Aiden, if I can't send this letter, what am I supposed to do? Brand new. High capacity batteries. Okay. All right. You know what? You scared the crap out of me. What? What did you do? Wait, would you go to an electronics store? I, uh, I stole it from a uh, police patrol car. It's pretty cool, huh? Yeah, yeah. It's it's cool. It's pretty risky though, but brilliant. I mean, this way we can keep track of the cops and we'll know what they're doing at all times. Yeah, true. That's not why I took it though. Then why? This is my way of, of saying thanks for nursing me back to health. You can't send that letter, but you can reach out to him. That computer is the way you connect to Zach. I can use this to contact Zach? Yeah, it's totally untraceable. By email? But, but won't, won't the cops be all over Zach's computer? I mean, wouldn't they be here in like five minutes? Who said anything about email? 